everybody welcome back to another video this video is a continuation of my previous video it's probably gonna get a lot less views as the other one did pretty well for the first 10 12 hours i believe of the video but anyways guys in today's video i'm gonna be showing you guys how to actually prevent your discord from crashing by this this has been recommended a little and i'm just gonna be showing you guys how to do it it's pretty damn simple and if you guys do enjoy this tutorial please just leave a like and a comment you don't need to subscribe unless you want to see more tutorials like this but if you do please make sure to subscribe and join my discord down below in the description for more things like this anyways guys without further ado i'll stop boring you and i'll get into the actual tutorial so it's quite simple and all you guys are going to do is open your discord go over to user settings and here we're going to go over to um i believe accessibility yes and this is pretty easy to do as you guys can see uh this setting will probably be on by default and this will also be on so what you're going to want to do is uncheck this and then basically gifs will not automatically play and the reason why this is good is because the way this exploit works is a certain gif <laughs> i don't have the gif right now as you guys see i have some very interesting gifs but um you see this it, it actually what it happens is i think there's a sort of certain thing that when it reaches a part of the video it sends something and somehow crashes your discord others have replicated it in like the past few days when this whole thing came out but as you guys can see you'll need to hover over it for the gif to play or gif whatever you guys like to say but i think gif is correct and it, you know leave a comment about that if you want but basically you need to hover over this in order to actually play it so it'll prevent you from crashing by any of these gif type exploits by the way, I do have another one coming up soon, which is going to cover some other types of GIFs you can use, obviously for educational purposes. Oop. Anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's video, and hopefully it was quite helpful, and I hope that I helped a lot of you prevent you guys from getting crashed, because obviously the previous video was educational, so I don't want to leave it without another crash. I'm going to put this in the